Hey, here we go. KSYM, San Antonio College Radio. This is the Urban Suite D Major. Cheryl Meadow, Lokito Rico here with us. So, um, you said um, coming into 2020 during the pandemic uh, was really kind of your spark of right. getting you really into music. Um, any inspirations of um, just wanting to do it at that, at that point? Uh, considering all the times that, like I said, Cheryl and I will see you out filming. Right, right, right. You know, what, what led you to really get deep into uh, your music? I mean, um, like I said, uh, everything I else, everything I, uh, that I did inside my life, I, music was always the burning passion. Mm -hmm. And when 2020 hit, I was like, you know what? It's time for me to hone in on what what is for me. Because if it wasn't for me, it wouldn't be just a burning desire. You know, it's kind of like when God's knocking at your door. It's kind of just pulling at your soul. Yeah. And that's exactly what it was. And um, um, my first song was actually a pa, a pa, a pa, a political song. Just uh -huh. uh, speaking against police, brew, brew, town. Litty and stuff like that, yeah. and that's against you know uh, blacks. That's against Spanish ice, all that stuff. You know everything's going on, but definitely when George Floyd happened, uh, that's when. Um, so I I made a song called "We um, uh, You Got the Power," mm -hmm. and that's basically saying the cops and the judges, and, and it's like now the ball's in your your court. You're in a position of power. You need to do something with it, you know right. what I'm saying? And make sure that this doesn't happen. This is senseless killing. These are this is crazy stuff happening. It shouldn't happen like that. And we're not talking about Martin Luther King Day. We're not talking about slavery day. We're not talking about Jim Crow. We're talking about now. We're talking about twenty twenty. This is still happening and it's just it was crazy, you know. Yeah. So that was one of the first songs that I, I that I went back and did. Um even in two thousand twelve I made a Barack Obama song just supporting his second campaign. Uh -huh. There there was a bill he he was trying to pass, which was to house a lot of the vets that live on the streets and stuff like that. So I was just trying to bring awareness to that, that type of stuff, you know what I'm saying? But I think now with the technology and everything that's going on, um, I'm really getting a, a, a hold of how to make this work. Yeah. How to get my message across, how to put my music out there. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, with uh, a lot of music that you have uh, in your arsenal already. Right. And, and up and available on your website. Right, right. Uh, are you looking at going into maybe doing doing another type of a, a political or community awareness type track? Uh, anytime I, soon? I mean, uh, there's nothing in mind at the moment uh, that... that uh, that has come to my attention, but yeah, I'm always down to uh, do songs to empower the people, yeah. uh, to bring the voice back to the people. Awesome, awesome. Um, as as I uh, mentioned with uh, Cheryl before, um, yeah, production is oh so good. Yeah, oh, so um, good. I, I can see the growth. <laughs> bad, I can see and hear the growth. Bad, so. bad vibe. Um, Drag, 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 dragon is 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 the man behind it all. Mm -hmm. Um, I give him what I give him, and he makes it, you know, he makes it perfect. You know what I'm saying? So, I give him the batter, he makes cake. You know, so <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dragon, so. San Antonio legend for sure. So, My goodness. shout outs to dragon, shout outs to the whole team there, um, and. You know, I went with him the first song back in 2020, and I I, I didn't go to nobody else since. So, wow. he's he's really been, um, oh. he he really cares about what the music sounds like. Mm -hmm. He's he's not in it for the dollar. You know what I'm saying? He's in it for because that's his passion. Yeah, it's to make it sound good. You know what I'm saying? Like he really has a ear for it. So, yeah. That's what's up. You know, people are doing solid work, and exactly. why, why why make a change? Exactly. Um, as we've all noticed, and you even have uh, posted here on on your bio, um, the stampering. Right. Um, 
Um, is it is it a um, it's obviously not a deterrent from no. what you what you're doing because right, you're putting right. out product right, that people right. are thoroughly enjoying. Right, right. Um, has it always been an issue up until this point, or is it just a fact of life that you know you know you'd have to deal with it, but you know it's not stopping you. Right. No. Um. I've always had like a stuttering issue. Um. Since I was a kid. Um. But when I rap, it, it's not there. And I, I and and I think that's why I love rapping even more. It's because I got my freedom of expression. I got my freedom of speech back. I I I have my voice back. You know. Mm -hmm. Like there's nothing stopping me at this point. Once that beat comes on, that's it. It's over. Yeah. And um. It, and I think that's just another testimony of like, hey, don't let nothing stop you. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, I've been deal, dealing with this. Um, but what made it worse was when I was in the military, mm -hmm. um, I uh, was encountered by over a uh, certain amount of bombs, roadside bombs while I was out there. I got a T T T B I, which is a traumatic brain injury mm -hmm. and um it, it i used to be able to freestyle and think fast now now i can't it, it's, it's almost impossible for me to yeah. just like like freestyle on on, on the beat which really frustrates me i used to rap a lot faster as well but now it's like slow down a little bit but i still love the whole create creation of art you know like i have a very creative mind so from the beginning of like a of a thought and then put it down on paper and then to put it on a beat and then to record it and then to see the full final product is like ah, it's perfect you know that's what's up yeah um um one last thing before we get to uh asking about your social media are you working on anything right now what can we expect for you um last half of uh, 2023 well I just dropped a EP to uh, to uh, to a day. Uh, I'm in a uh, it's a uh, I'm one half of the group called Sons of Rag okay. Ragnar. Uh, the album is called Viking Rap, mm -hmm. and basically what it is is like we created our own sound. We're invading the rap game and we're here to take it over. So that's what it is. And we chose 9-11 nine, 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 to, to drop it. Uh, this is a album that we've been working on for a year and a half or going on two, two years at first. Uh, but we wanted to make an impact and make something hopefully that stays around as long, you know, and also to pay homage to like the survive I mean to the people that are uh, survived you know it's like hey you know saying so this is something like hey they the terrorists came and tried to in of invade us but that you know now we you know just taking that same type of notion that we're gonna in in uh in uh innovate the hip-hop game you know saying so and we're fighting back so that's dope um, social media, how can people uh, stay in contact with you? Lokito Rico on TikTok, uh, Lokito Rico, um, C Y I M on um, Facebook, and then on the gram is L zero K I T zero R I C zero. So, there you go. There you go. Oh, and always, uh, you can go to uh, LokitoRico.com. LokitoRico.com, all the links are right above. Hey, y'all, stay tuned. Um, Vincent D. Webb has arrived. So we will speak with him shortly about uh, the special Jill West Day. So stay tuned for that. In this block of music, we have the latest from uh, D. Gord Plus, a track from Triz and Money Montage. But right now, another track from Lakita Rico. This is Club Bahia. Which one is Oh, Rockstar Money. Oh, Rockstar Money, yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah, so I actually had a live guitarist come in and and uh, lace that down, so I nice. hope you enjoy. All right. Hey, y'all, stay tuned. More coming up. This is the Urban Suite KSYM, San Antonio College Radio.